the Kit Kat Club welcomes you nightly to the bawdy, saucy, decadent world of 1930s Berlin. Riding high on the winds of four Tony Awards in 1998, including Best Revival of a Musical, Cabaret has been reinvented, reshaped in a new space, appropriately Studio 54, which is remembered for its wildness of the 1970s. And with each new cast member, the show becomes broader and richer. Mama thinks I'm living in a convent. The vivacious Susan Egan is the new Sally Bowles. I sort of um, think of Sally as the queen of denial with style. Anything that's happening that is inconvenient to her cause, she ignores. She'd rather die in a year than live 30 in some suburb. But as an actress, I don't envy Sally, but I do love playing her. Standing in the middle of Studio 54 for me was a thousand volts of deja vu. So I could not wait for Susan to take us backstage. It looks quite different than it did in the 70s, right? The, this building originally was an opera house, and then, of course, it became Studio 54. If you look up and everything, they've built it to look like an old theater in Berlin in the 30s. Look, there's a disco ball right up in the middle. Ah! See? Fabulous. See? There you go. They've got lighting here that really 